I'm the Programming and Fundraising Coordinator here at the Beachwood Cemetery. Today I'm going to take you around to a few of my favorite spots. Behind me is a beautiful showing of the power of time. This monument belongs to the Ring family. There are only two people buried here. Edward Ring, who immigrated from Ireland, worked as a civil servant who died at the age of 60 in 1901. Buried next to him is his four month old son that actually passed away only nine days before he did. Beechwood is an example of a classic 19th century rural cemetery, meaning that it's very park-like in its atmosphere with all the trees and the greenery, creating a very beautiful and peaceful space. Just thinking about how over the past 100 years, this tree has grown. It's just, I find it really beautiful to see how nature's adapted over time. Standing guard outside of our veteran section is one of my favorite features here at Beachwood. It is an HVSS Sherman Easy 8 tank. They are equipped with a 76 millimeter high velocity gun and the Easy 8 references the retrofitted hull to have horizontal spring suspension, making it a smoother ride. This tank, which used to stand outside of the old Canadian War Museum, was gifted to Beachwood in 2004. Funny enough, when it arrived, it used to say Catherine on it. A few years back, Beachwood brought in the Maltross group to refurbish and repaint the tank. During the process, the original serial number for this tank was discovered. While this is still a Sherman tank, it's actually a later version. The only physical differences you can see from the outside is that this has a tread three inches wider. It was given the name Hussar after the 8th Canadian Hussars, the longest serving tank regiment in the Canadian Army. Carmen Jolica was born in Costa Rica in 1926. She then moved with her family to Montreal, and as a small young girl, she took ballet and dance at the Montreal School of Fine Arts. At the age of 22, Carmen was given a four-year bursary by the Spanish government to go to Spain and study Spanish style of dance. There, she had a great aptitude for the flamingo and began performing across Europe. In 1973, her and her family moved to Ottawa and she began teaching Flamingo at the Classical Ballet School of Ottawa. She is the first performer and teacher of Spanish dance in Canada. Nestled in the far eastern corner of the Beechwood grounds lies a small natural oasis. Named after John McCowan, a Canadian naturalist known as the Dominion Botanist who is also buried at Beechwood, the McCowan Marsh is a small urban wetland the Beechwood Cemetery Foundation looks after. This undisturbed and quiet area is a perfect place for local school children to come to our outdoor classroom to learn about the biodiversity of this area. Filled with all kinds of wildlife, ranging from foxes, to salamanders, to great blue herons, the McCowan Marsh offers school children a place to learn community, a place to come and relax, and the nature that resides here, a place to call home.